Hello, my name is Janet and I am doing a tutorial on the app Leonardo currently only for iOS. It's an editing app and I just love using it. It's kind of like my um, Photoshop for the iPad or the iPhone. So yeah, so right now I am going to show you how to do a blending app or the type of blending that I like to do. Um, it's really quick, really simple. You just need two screen caps that look similar that kind of go with it. Right now I'm using a sky and I'm going to use this and I'm just going to mer um, merge them or blend them together. Um, um, a couple of things you would like to do is get screen caps that go together with the same similar color scheme, with the same, with no heads chopped off, with anything that just goes. If it goes, then you could do it. Um, but yeah, I recommend no heads chopped off because as you can see right now, I'm using the linear grading tool that you can find on the mask setting. And yeah, so I just blended them in. As you could saw, it did a wonderful job. Oh, you have to make sure that the layers are overlaying so it could do a beautiful blend and now I'm doing a duplicate layer so I could bring back the heads because I kind of don't want the heads to be chopped off so I use the rectangular tool to undo it and just bring it back the heads because I want it to be a blended thing but I don't want I kind of want it to look like one picture and yeah so just kind of go to, um, I'm just on the single layer thing and just kind of bringing back everything because that's what you do you make them look um, good. Um, I'm not going to do a great job at this. If I was going to make like more effects on the thing, I would have like make sure I'm actually bringing them back good. But since it's just going to be a blend and it's going to look like a one same picture, it doesn't really matter how it looks. You know, as long as it looks good on the overall thing, it should be fine. So I'm just bringing back the hair and just, you know, going with it. Um, go to layers and I'm going to add uh, the little thing I like to do, you put screen so you can see what, what you're doing. You'll go to filters and go to the add big, big net or whatever it's called and just add like the thing if you want. If you don't want, then do whatever you want. But yeah, I just kind of like doing this. I don't know why. It's just like a fun thing that I just think looks cute. Um, now I am going to um, take it off and just save the things because I want the picture to look brighter so I'm just gonna make a duplicate um, layer of that so you could also merge and just duplicate the layer but I don't know why I like doing this and just go to um, screen and it looks brighter it looks a little bit better um, now I'll just bring any textures you like if you like textures you could find great textures on DeviantArt and I'm just gonna find this texture this is from an app mixed textures I just kind of took it from the app but yeah so I'm just going to blend that in or um not blend but use one of the blend mo modes and screen and just kind of do it i'm just going to lower the op opacity and yeah you're pretty much done unless you want to keep going with it um other apps you could use is afterlight and Fonto to add some text in there and just work with it and yeah bye i will talk to you later um if you want more tutorials just ask and comment below or go to my uh, edit seminars and uh, request anything and yeah i'll see you later bye